fuck out of here. All right. This is what I like to see. I am going to play a little bit of music and let people join in. I will do my spiel and talk my talk. I'm going to just play a song that I've actually just been bumping because he is the homie and he is fire. So I am going to play it. But this is Get Got by Kairu Wick. <laughs> Kinda laggy like Smash Neko. I turn to a demon slayer, mixed with it like Nesco. Yeah. One minute they blowing on my wood shit like they Jethro. Jethro. Next they putting your name on a list like this is Death Note. Jethro. I'm just trying to help my dogs eat like I'm a Petco. But it's hard, share at equal parts of nothing when the net low. net low. You got all them leeches in your circle, homie, let go. Let go. Don't try shoot the messenger, I am already dead though. Got my coffin padded, coffin couple padded. racks inside the mattress, send me automatic. automatic. Back, just listening to Royce and Inside my starter jacket starter I heard jacket. some fly though I got equipment I oughta flack it Auto Been down that's awful tragic CD they gotta tag it gotta See tag me it. no running from the ops And I just cop a package Hit the package. stadium in the city You drop the baggage drop the See baggage. if anyone can save you For the bomb is active bomb is Savage active. the day they put knife in my back Was awful jagged awful Yeah, jagged. Waiting for the day I generated Power profit from incinerating Everything I touch and I've been bending breaking Every bar that I've been put in front of And I dare you tell me I'm not dedicated I ain't having motherfucking Easy and this music turning on my medication. I ain't shooting from a free throw, but I'm on a court and hella faded. I ain't know where I was going, all I knew is that I had to elevate it. Every beat to me is Nagasaki. When the time I start, I gotta decimate it. Here the game has got a firewall, I turn a hacker man and fucking penetrate it. Yeah. Fuck it, if you fail, give your best shot Don't be stuck because you fucking scared Do it, that's pop Love this fucking music and I'm happy with my guest spot Don't mistake me for an easy target You can get got, get got play probably a couple more songs to make sure people are piling in and all that yep. good stuff but first i want to verify can i am i being heard am i being heard clearly is the question that's what i would like people to can you guys hear me is what i would like to <laughs> yeah you know we're out here out here out here do I sound good though? Am I sounding good? What's good, season? Yeah, just want to make sure I sound good. I'm going to play a little more music. I know I'm on a 10 second delay, so I'm not going to sit here and wait. But I'm going to play a single that the homie D. Medi, who's in the chat right now, and I put out. And it is a good time featuring D. Wizzle Nation. Yo, this John D. I cut off his new album. A little sprung off of the news that we get Heard the sheep, no corny M lines The rules that we set, go to sleep Breathing them chem lines or chem trails Conspiracies true enough, but they still fail Like white people murdering kids Charged, still made bail, defunding them cuffs As if other gangs don't exist I'm talking KKK, Confederates Republicans, I know, I know that sounds wild Like I'm pointing a blind finger Like them boys online triggered, they screaming out My nigga, my nigga. Just for you, I'll pull the trigger But only if it's at one in the same my nigga, I can only shoot if you feel my pain My two to your brain, my mental is drained I'm confusing disdain, but just don't call me insane My membrane was developing through these war-torn traumas So keep it plain, yeah Before my teens, yeah, my mental was stained I knew some soldiers never served and they still walk with that cane A leg shot, be the least of they problems Probably they moms too, weight of an entire community Then times two is what we carry in hard times too They find you, we out here fearing red, white, and blue Yes, that's times two Spitting that rhyme food Hoping labels will find you Committing a school sports Chasing finish lines They drew Avoiding injuries So you invest in they got to Because you're on top You leave all of your pride behind you uh, I know it sounds like I attack my people Just want their eyes open So that they address pure evil Don't need no hashtag No t-shirts for our lost people Because at this point We way past the goddamn sequel It's John D Liddy off the spark of ideas It's heavy potent rings And printed on the table Cause Meddy is never coasting In a minute calm and able But steady it never growing And the gimmicks and the label The deadliest clever dopest person 
Now we burn it when I preach the sermon. The sheep's worse and please the servant for the least deserving. Getting fleeced by the regime, your the machine is working. Spin the wool, use like tools and defeat they purpose. Your flock to something wild, materialism out of hand. Goal is mutton town, but y'all play the role of rack of lamb. Ridiculous. Free your mind, see the signs, really hope y'all saw them. Or entertain the BS all cause y'all averse to boredom. Know when it occupies your mind, it only leads to space. Knowledge ups the value, know your worth, bro, increase your rates. Then the non essential can't be consequential. Free to do what you were meant to, only jewels are being your mental. Speed up the pace and you'll see what it takes. Keep your foot on the gas and you'll be on your way. Never stop like the road is cheap and misplaced, but the core cutters blow. Yes, these are the brakes. Even if you hit a wall, keep going, can't win them all. I'ma get involved. Many the executor, about to carry out and roll them all. Spark the heat like a pilot light. Was a silent type, now I'm speaking my mind, I like how I've grown. Lit off the spark of ideas in his own, stone day and gone. Nah, nah, I'm not, I'm not playing it through the iRig. I'm playing it through um, Streamlabs OBS. I use the iRig if I'm doing directly to like, um, you know, Instagram Live and all that shit like that. I, I only use that for like the iPhone, for like phones and shit like that. I use the OBS to set this up on my uh, my PC laptop, on my Windows laptop. So I get all fancy with this shit. I, I just realized it looks fancy. I got my, my grow lights over here next to me, so. Oh, yeah, I appreciate you having me on that track, man. That track fucking slaps, you know, and I was in that. I, I mean, I've been in a nice little political mode. I mean, especially around when we wrote it, so I was having a good time with that. But, yeah, man, you, you got to get you. Hey, man, if you're trying to get your stream on, you got to get you on some... Uh, Twitch is fun, man. I actually enjoy me some fucking Twitch, man. I'm not mad at it. Definitely something to fuck with. And I got to start. I've been diving into ever since that day. You had me diving into those um, clubhouses and shit. I'm trying to dive into some some real fucking some real fucking uh, clubhouse shit. Clubhouse is wild. And uh, <laughs> season and sneaker bot. Yeah, I feel you on that, bro. Technology is a wild place, bro. But you know what's crazy? No matter how much shit people exploit and find out in technology, there's always something with money that's going to come and try to fucking monitor it like that whole fucking GameStop gate and all that other shit going on which is a good time you know your boys about that reddit life so you you know your boy was a part of it but um shit is fucking wild but uh all right i'm gonna play probably one more single and then i'm gonna let people vibe and join on in i don't know what single i'm feeling right now but i want to play something that was fun I do fucks with me some, got some Long Island artists, who do we want to play? I could play some of the homies, I know a bunch of people, you know, let me see. It's a lot, there's a lot going on here. I don't even know who to fucking play, I'm on fucking iTunes playing some wild shit. One of my homeboys, West, that I got a song coming out with, he's... He's a wild dude, but he's always doing his, he be doing his rap rap thing. It's crazy because me and him both came from like the hardcore background, but you know, gotta do what you gotta do. Gotta do what you gotta do. But yeah, I'm gonna play one of his things. This is off his Crimson's twin, Crimson Twins. I don't want to play off his new stuff because I'm reviewing his new stuff and I haven't had a chance to listen to it, but hey, fuck it. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> He got a real old school sound. Oh, actually. Like hands, cut off his hands, and I replaced him with a chainsaw, a circular sharp side. 
life leaves your brain sore, I'ma get what I came for. I'm in the sharp tank, shining just like my main saw. We in the sharp tank, shining just like our main saw. I said, hey yo, let's get these pesos, making bankrolls with our eyes closed. I said, hey yo, let's get these pesos, making bankrolls with our eyes closed. I said. It's like an old school thing. It's just okay, but it's he's mad old school, but I rock with it. I, I rock with Wes. Figure I'd give him a little bit of love. He got um he caught a, a repost from Snoop for rapping at um rapping in front of Walmart and that shit was mad. That shit was high key, like golden. But he's out here, man. Wes is a cool dude, man. He's a cool dude. Me and his hardcore stuff was very heavily in, influenced by, you know, the hip hop stuff. So me and him, we always vibed, especially when we used to play shows and stuff together. So that was always a good time. But hey, you know, gotta live life sometimes. You feel me? But um, all right, man. I'm gonna put out a little SOS. I want to switch, make sure people come in because a bunch of people submitted. And I'm not trying to have them miss out, and then they can't hear it when I fucking go through the. Uh, you know how fucking when you go through fucking Instagram, I mean not Instagram, YouTube and stuff, you get all those flags and all those claims and all that stuff like that. So long story short, I'm gonna give them eh, two more seconds, but I figure I could jump into it. So just to give this some sort of formal introduction, I am John D. Contradiction and this is not your man's. I am going to get my review on and I am going to probably be as brutally honest as I can be for these singles. I'm in a good mood today, so I think everything's going to be a little bit. I think I'm going to be a, a very friendly, friendly individual when it comes to these things. So we'll see how that goes. I, I, I believe I'm going to be friendly today. I feel it. But I mean, you know, if something bad comes on, that ruins my mood. It is what it is. But um, so we do this every Monday, unless there's like some sort of holiday or some shit like that. And I figured today would be a perfect day to do it. We got the snow Monday, so there's no excuse for people not to come in and support their stuff. But um, yeah, man, I'm out here. I uh, I run this page. We do reviews. Tomorrow, I'm actually doing a album review. We're going to do Andy Means' Kuda High Dope Boy 3. So that's going to be a good time. He's a dope dude. We actually stumbled upon him a couple of years ago because he had a verse on a Riff Raff album that I destroyed. And he was like, yo, what'd you think of my verse? And since then, we kind of rocked with him. We did an interview with him and all sorts of shit like that. Very West Coast sounding. He's a lot of a lot of street dope talk. He's dope. Very simple, very old school, but he's fire. So that's going to be tomorrow's. We're going to do that full project review. I might throw in a bonus one because it's not that long. 
So if somebody specifically wants me to do theirs and they have something, reach out to me. There's no charge for anything we're doing on that on that tip. But um, yeah, let me know. Send me that link. If it's not too long, I'll probably do that one too because his project's nine songs, I think. So I'm probably going to be done with that real quick. And um, other than that, yeah, let's get right into these singles. So a lot of these are mixed up. I'm going to put all the links and all that stuff in the description and blah, blah, blah. So if you want to just listen to what we got. I was starting to cook them up into like a little bit of a playlist, but everybody's very inconsistent when you send in um, reviews and stuff. Not everybody's rocking with like all the platforms and stuff like that. Some people are sending me, you know, fucking YouTube and the godforsaken SoundCloud. And then I got some exclusives too from some homies in here, which... I'm going to get those going too in their direct songs. Those are like final mixes and shit like that. So, you know, for the most part, you'll be able to do it. But I mean, those ones will play. Those ones, those exclusive ones will play. You won't have any issues bumping that for sure because it's not on anything. I won't get a copyright claim. But I'm going to get a copyright claim on everything else. But that's fine, man. We out here living. We out here doing our reviews for music. But other than that, man... We got confirmation everybody can hear me good and everybody can hear the music. So I am going to start this off. The first one that we got. I'm going to start this timer off at 16.28. You see me typing and shit. That means I'm updating stuff because I'm very OCD. So I'm getting my, uh, you know, I'm just making sure my timestamps and all that are good. So this first one that I am about to rock with is cold. Oh, man, this is from some dudes that I really do rock with. So this one's called Rappers in Space by the uh, Space Force, which is D-Cure, the Marine Rapper, and this dude named Topher. So let's check these dudes out. We rock with... Uh, In the spaceship, moving through an asteroid field. You can tell we rock. You can tell we rock. You know Timmer got a rifle. Topher is doing real. Then we got it locked. Yeah, we got it locked. That's in the base. Rappers in space, something sour for your face. Go give me your case. Got invaders to a race. Bumping those 808s. Grab a new pair that we lace. Then we gotta walk right out this place. Yeah, yeah. My motion say, don't feel bad, I told the kid. Do not say my acronym. I don't play, I'm over skits. All of you boots get broken in. On the very lane, we open it. Put a rapper in a black hole in that. Rappers in space, you knew the risk. No canes with us. Vapor and dust with the gas in the chamber. No blanking with us. You never got to do when you need it, but then you act like one. Can I find out what is making it rust? Hurry, you don't want to go too far. Or find a new star this basement to trust Then you can hear what's placed in us When we appear in amazing brush We all rappers here Best son of the atmosphere Dressing around the stratosphere Just know that my strap is here Whoa, huh. Got in my country I'm feeling devoted to page for every one reason I wrote it I always say the reaction was good And I signed a deal Making sure that it's known In the spaceship Moving through an asteroid field You can tell we rock You can tell we rock You know Timmer got a rifle Topher is doing real Then we got it locked yeah, we got it locked. That's in the base. Rappers in space. Something sour for your face. Go give me your case. Got invaders to a race. Bumping those 808s. Grab a new pair that we lace. Then we gotta walk right out this place. Yeah, yeah. When I was in D.C., there were millions seeking justice. Marching through the streets, holding in line, nobody budging. Oh, yeah. Reached the capital, taking selfies, officers bludgeoned. Now they want to say, told for your song, the reason why they bugging. Uh, Can't believe you want to blame us. Blame us. Cause a couple ignoramus. Ramus. Me and Toe was rocking stages taping when they broke inside the place it's crazy all the fake that you can save it save it if you wasn't in the radius radius even when a song was taken down climbing billboard twice now put the mic down they don't want us on an airway we don't want to do it their way you know my space that's their space going away y'all fair play one free speech better say it's out what goes online is taken down share this if you want to make them proud open up and tell they get to break it down the spaceship moving through an asteroid field you can tell we rock you can tell we rock you know timmer got a rifle Topher is doing real then we got it locked. Yeah, we got it locked. That's in the base. Rappers in space. Something sour for your face. Go give me your case. Got invaders to a race. Bumping those 808s. Grab a new pair that we lace. Then we gotta walk right out this place. Yeah. I am not mad at that, man. That track, <laughs> that track, I keep slap. <laughs> so I fuck with that. All rip. Uh, D Cure, I like D Cure, man. He got a crazy voice, but it's different, and I like it. And he got this really like rubber bandy type flow where his shits go fast and slow, fast and slow, and all that shit. So I'm not mad at that, but I rock with it, man. The fucking, you know, one rappers in space, space force shit. I love it. The shit like that is always gonna be gold, especially the fact that they all serve. But you also got fucking 
the contrast, bro. They all had crazy voices. They all sounded completely different. They all just started rapping in completely different. Like they all had switched up their styles a couple times. So that contrast is dope, bro. That's that's a fire. That's a fire for sure. Yeah, fucking. If you want to check these dudes out, man, I'm gonna throw this link up in here so you guys can peep. But this is the first one, rappers in space. I'm gonna give that one an easy fire emoji because I was partying with that. But this is all of them right here. Oh, DQ. I don't know if he's in here, but it should fucking tagged him like it was gonna get him in there but yeah that's the track right there you want to add it to your playlist and all that good stuff get after it but yeah that one's easy fire man that's a party track the beat's simple but the beat was dope but it was simplish but i feel like they brought that shit to life like, you know what i'm saying like i feel like if they weren't on there wigging that beat would just be a bit a bit plain but super dope man super dope so this next one is called distractions by tank mccoy shout out to the lord all right my man tank mccoy bringing that that religious flair, man, I love it, man. His religious raps, he be, he be out here snapping for the Lord. I'm not mad at it. Let's get this rocking. They tell me I ain't got the energy to make it. I tell them I ain't got no memory for hating. It's the pressure for the heavenly blessings in my enemies. All things working like the lazy shit. They tell me, Tank, you ain't really bad at that shit. I said, oh, wait, you don't really know my problems. They say my faith been falling in the fractions. I say it's Satan, but all this distraction, all this distraction. Yeah, they trying to get the bro, hit me, relax. I never been opposed, always been a sucker for chilling with some centerfolds. Xbox and some Netflix text message in a different post. Never trying to get my soul, put me on a different grind. People trying to take my money, demons want to take my time. Evil overtakes my mind. Holy like Spirit, this. take it back. Put that Bible to my lips, you know that I be facing facts. Flesh is yelling, chase the cash, spirit, help me catch my breath. I start looking good, but after every check, I'm still in debt. Cherish every millisecond, if I got time, I'm still in threat. I feel it in my filaments And all these whispers in my ear Just be attaching to my fears They have my back, stab my back Ain't been this savage in some years now They tell me I ain't got the energy to make it I tell them I ain't got no memory for hating It's suppression for the heavenly blessings And my enemies, all things working like the lazy ship They tell me, Tank, you ain't really bad at that shit Wait, you don't really know my problems. They say my faith been falling in the fractions. I say it's Satan, but all this distraction, all this distraction. Checking the feet, wrecking the time, spending with thee. Been on defeat, I'm stressing acceptance of being a secular second to me. Hectic and messed up is he, but over the years he learned to keep his composure. Bottle it down, walk into town, put on a smile so nobody knows. Oh. Dang, I just gave up my secret. Depression creeping, who's encouraging my brother's keeper? Reach out for help, so I thought, but I ain't really seeking. I've been killing demons, but I still see them breathing. I've been seeing blessings, but I don't feel deserving. God know I'm grateful, but I don't feel I've earned it. But it's spirit burning, and Lord know I'm willing. So I dust myself off, cause it's souls to win. Devil never gonna get my soul. But he wanna. He wanna get my soul. They tell me I ain't got the energy to make it. I fuck with I tell this. Them I ain't got no memory for hate. Time, it's the pressure for the heavenly blessings to my enemies. All things working like the lazy ship. They tell me, Tank, you ain't really bad at that shit. I tell them, wait, you don't really know my problems. They say my faith been falling in the fractions. I say it's Satan, but all this distraction, all this distraction. Devil never gonna get my soul. But he wanna <laughs> I fuck with this. He heavy. wanna get my soul. Oh yeah. I fuck with that heavy, bro. I like I yo, I'm a fan, bro. If you already do a new age stuff with a dope religious message, but you still keeping it very real too, like I'm fu I'm a fucking fan. Like that's just so unique, so original to me. You know what I'm saying? He didn't do the full sellout for the Lord thing and that whole shit that people do. He didn't fucking release a Kanye album or any bullshit like that. Like I fuck with this. Like he's got a message. He's keeping relevant with what the the fucking popular sounds are. Like what the kids are doing. He's talking about fucking his demons and like good and bad. Like I'm here for that whole shit, bro. Like that's some complex ass writing, bro. Like fucking, it's a fucking vibe, bro. I'm fucking here for that, man. This shit is very fucking cool, man. For me, that's gonna be. For me, that's another fire for the day, man. That's 
that's a fire for me because of just off of sheer originality the beat was bat was bopping his voice is crazy the hook was good i even like that crazy singing shit like that he was doing at the end i'm here for it bro that shit's dramatic as fuck like i'm here for it bro that shit was fucking a good ass fucking time bro so i'm very I'm very much a fan of that so this next one is called find yourself by 1 a.m so this is a lady i believe i feel like we've reviewed i've reviewed it before. Make the jump, yeah, over that wall. I've been traveling alone, but I can't deal with it all. Take a couple shots down, make the world spin around. It's all a let down, so what's the point in it all? Huh? This black cloud try to follow me. It be hungry for my life, but something keeps calling me. There comes a point where you can give up a quit, or you can take a stand now, overcoming that shit. On the rail, on the rail. We all looking for love. We want it all, but the world ain't enough. Won't let it go, man, it all piles up. Out of sight, out of mind, swept under the rug. And hey, how you gon' win when you ain't right with it? How you gon' win when you ain't right with it? How you gon' win when you ain't right with it? To become self aware behind the calls and the texts, it's a warfare. Gotta be careful, the playing field is all games. No off switch, man. I don't blame Kanye. We weren't prepared for this fast paced lifestyle. Better redefine print before you sign the white file. I'm just speaking what I know, aware of what they don't show. Waiting on the truth, no show. It's so easy if you open your eyes. They get you and finesse you with lies. Huh? And in time, we tend to lose our minds. And I wouldn't be sitting here asking God why. Why am I alive? Why the lonely Thanks for the follow, for Perry the Cole. Battling the demons, hoping there's a bright side. It's all woe, I know there's more to this life. Right? Yeah. How you gon' win when you ain't right with it? How you gon' win when you ain't right with it? Starting off fucking, uh, hold up, hold up, pause, relax. So we starting off fucking very, very solid, man. I rocked with that. That to me was a vibe, 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 vibe. Easy, easy water emoji, man. Like you had the, she was rapping her ass off, solid. The hook, you know, the, the nostalgia hook. The hook was the only thing that kind of took a little bit away from me, but the nostalgia hit, I'm not mad at it. I like that whole, you know. How you gonna win if you ain't right within the whole Lauren Hill thing? Super dope, super dope, but I feel like that hook could have been delivered a little bit better, but still, it was still clean. It wasn't bad. Verse was dope. The production was very smooth. She was just fucking like Aladdin and the beat was the magic carpet. She was fucking coasting on it, bro. Like she was having a good fucking time, bro. Super, super solid, man. Very, very, very dope sound. Yeah, for sure. Very, very fucking dope sound, man. I'm not mad at that at all, man. She was fucking vibing, bro. I'm here for it, bro. Keep that shit up. She's nice as hell. And whoever produced that also did their fucking thing. I can't even I can't even complain. So we're gonna jump into this next one. So this next one, hold up. I'm over here copying shit. This next one here is whoa, that's a huge fucking name. Troubles music. All right, hold on. This is fucking crazy. This dude's name is wild. So this one's called Smile by Troubles Music featuring Cash Lord Mess. 
So we might be getting into that fucking hour or that moment where shit gets a little wild. Hold on. Somebody was knocking on my door. My man was just knocking the, knocking the snow off his shovel. My bad. But anyways, this one's called Smile by Troubles featuring Cash Lord Mess. This is the dirty version, I guess, so it's probably a not one, but... definitely on the same page with this one so beat was dope beat was dope first dude was okay but i'm not gonna let that one plus one equals two and the zero plus zero equals zero. i'm not letting that line slide throw that out like i know you want to do some simple impactful shit or if you know baby moms held a knife to your nuts and said you had to put something in the song for her and you were like this is this is what i gotta do don't do it just get sliced all right it's crazy. The second dude, oh my God, bro. I don't know if those pauses, if he wrote pause on his paper where he wrote his bars or he actually was gathering his breath. That song was so boring because of him. And it's only two and a half minutes and that dude definitely made it more boring. Like that's gonna get a sleeper emoji for me because it was just, beat. but the beat was fucking cold. And it's upsetting because the beat deserved way better than that. And the first dude wasn't terrible, but he didn't say nothing to fucking... You know, the second dude was confused. First dude didn't say nothing that, like, made me want to fucking... You know, like, he was just saying some simple shit. You got this cold-ass emotional... Whenever you have a high-pitched sample on something, it's the beat's going to be emotional, bro. That high-pitched sample just makes people feel things. Nobody knows why. You know, but it just makes you feel things. So say something meaningful, bro. Like one plus one, oh my God, equals two. Zero plus zero equals you. Oh my God. 
It did feel mad long, bro. And that second dude just fucking gasping to breathe was just, oh, saying nothing. He repeated the same line twice and as if it made it harder, bro. Get the fuck. You know what? It is what it is. I'm a, uh, we're going to skip one. So this next one is called Di- Diablo by AM Sniper. Hold on. AM Sniper. I think that's what it is. Yeah, Diablo by AM Sniper. All right, so we're going to. clean man I, i'm not mad at that one i would give that one a thumbs up but that's strictly off my preference it just that's not necessarily my kind of vibe i felt like uh the whole auto tune the whole thing and him just aggressively rapping and then into hook and just coming at me was a lot when i was just trying to vibe to the beat too but it was a vibe man he was doing his thing it was super clean he had the cool little ad libs all that relevant stuff like i could see that getting like stupid amounts of spins for sure like i'm not even mad at it just for me i'm not gonna fully fully dive into something like that like i wouldn't want to put that on loop it was a little long and i it, i i know i'm an, like annoyed by a song when i'm saying stuff in my head the way it sounds like i can hear homeboy have like somewhat of an accent or something like that but i'm just I'm immediately singing to myself the diablo like not in a fun way like not like i'm enjoying it like i'm just being a fucking a being annoying like if my little man was here i'd be harassing the shit out of him like just harassing him with this hook and it's just it was solid like i didn't hate it still it's a thumbs up thumbs up is cool but i didn't love it you know what i'm saying like i didn't i wasn't like blown away i feel like it's very standard 
especially to the industry stuff like that and all that good stuff. Like, it's very, you know, it's regular, bro. I've heard it a thousand times. Everybody's doing it. Diablo's a cool word, so nothing, you know, just saying it a bunch of times is going to get stuck in people's head. I get it. I get it. But, you know, a little bit, little bit cleaner on the mix, maybe... I don't know, man. Switch something up from the hook. Like, the hook was just the same way he was rapping, just with more auto-tune, you know. But it's not bad, though. That shit will definitely get more spin than I will ever get in my career of rap. So I ain't even mad at it, bro. Attack that industry the way you see fit. So this next one is uh, called Hole Up by uh, by Alpha Male. So let's get this rocking. Shout out to Alpha Male, though. Real shit. Getting active. I see you 3H motherfuckers out here. Active. it up in one hand straight to the bank no safe just stack it with a rubber band lame nigga be flexing i be the wife my nigga cause i'm the connection you ain't no plug you a jab nigga never chasing down the bag hold up hold up nigga never chasing down the bag never took what he wanted with a mask hold up hold up shit nigga put it on my tab big body bands whip it down the ab uh never got no love until we left the city got no love now they hating cause i'll never take them with nah, nah, nah. Put on for the city, yeah, lie on the 50, niggas hating, I ain't wait, nigga, come and get me. No cap, niggas hating on the low, all love till they see me on the road, like, whoa. Now everybody get it buzzing, everybody putting that work in. Let me see your top 10 music all right, but a nigga never went and got it popping. I'm the real McCoy, y'all niggas just gym class heroes. Roll the map twice, now I'm waiting on a reload. Level to this bitch, nah, nigga, we ain't equal. Yeah, you got bars, but niggas, they all local. I touch stages in every city I rode through. Local Used to get bars. it poppin' where I stand, now they sayin' that they hatin' cause I sold out. Whoa now, you never left the city on a plane getting paid, just to put a show down. Who real, who fake, huh? Who fake? I can count it up in one hand. one hand. Straight to the bank, no safe, just stack it with a rubber band. Rubber band. Lame nigga be flexing, I be the wife my nigga cause I'm the connection. Yeah. You ain't no plug, you a jab. Nigga never chasing on the bag. Hold up, hold up. Nigga never chasing on the bag. Never took what he wanted with a mask. Hold up, hold up. Shit nigga put it on my tab. Big body bands whip it down the F. Uh. Hold up. Never got no love until we left the city. Got no love. Now they hating cause I'll never take them with. Nah, 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 nah. I ain't hating on another nigga. Come up just saying that I ain't about the drama. No. Fed niggas, now they acting like I ain't the chef. Gave them life when I really should have gave them death. I done shows with legends. You hit Lupo, hoping you could pose with a legend. Game got tears, we ain't peers. No, put a lot of work in just to get here. And I ain't even reached my goals yet. When I'm tall, pretty sure there's something you ain't know about. And I ain't trying to flex, no, no. Just trying to get it through your fucking dome. Yeah, that boss is cool, but you should worry about your business. Focus in and stop trying to chase the gimmicks. Create a brand and start worrying about your image. Cause this is cool, but we won't worry about them millions. I'm gonna keep it a stack. I was not. I was. I wasn't fucking with that one. That one, honestly, is gonna get a, a thumbs down for me. I. uh I'm not feeling it, bro. Like, so for off of rip, I don't like what was happening. Like, as far as this, when he went into the singing after the hold up, hold up, and that, I wasn't really feeling that whole switch up. I wasn't feeling the whole, like, you're going to judge people for chasing waves, but you're doing the chase the wave thing. And you mentioned, like, talking about people saying you sold out. So obviously you did something to change your sound. And like the whole flex with stuff like that, you know, like mixed with the clever bars, I feel like there was more, there was more flex bars and more stuff that kind of was just sound appealing, like just to say stuff to sound cool, like the big body band stuff and just some lines. And I don't know, it just didn't feel, this track felt very just like, all right, it's a throwaway. This felt like a throwaway track. This felt like something that you're just throwing out there. Yeah, like, I, I wasn't fucking with it. It did feel, and you know, yeah, I'll keep it a stack. It did feel corny, like, the way, like, what Nick is saying, bro. It sounds corny. Like, it just felt forced. It felt tired. It felt like, yo, I'm just gonna put this out there. I'm just gonna throw this out there and see what the fuck happens. You know what I'm saying? And if not, we'll just forget about it. We'll just ride with it. Like, I, 
I didn't love it. I, I, I'm going to keep it a stack. And uh, now that's the homie, and I'll keep it a buck. Like, I, it just felt very off. Some of even, like, the rhymes were a little off time, and some stuff didn't really fit in place because it just felt like, yo, we're, di- we're, we're, we're dialing it in. We're calling it in. And that's, that's it. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm, I'm upset about that one. You know what I'm saying? I'm upset. All right. Hold up. Hold up. All right. I'm a little upset about it, but it is what it is, man. Like, you know, Alpha's got other stuff. I'm upset, too, because he's been on a bit of a roll, too. But it is what it is. I mean, the good thing is I know that he can put these tracks out regular. But, like, for this one, that's a thumbs down for me, man. That's a boo from me, bro. And, that you know, and that's keeping it real. That's because I love you. I'm going to keep it a stack. You know what I'm saying? Which I was not here for that. So this next one is called Frame of Mind by Apollo Sons. That's a cold ass name, Apollo Sons. I'm here for that. Okay. Okay. I love this sample, so it better be fire. So that one, uh, I'll give the review off rip. Like, so that one is a fucking thumbs up for me. The first ra- the first verse, I could absolutely do without. But the beat and the hook, I am fucking here for. The beat, the hook, yeah, that solo at the end, I am fucking here for. That shit was sliding. First verse, we can just throw that out. Because he was just legally, legally, legally. he's just rapping like a fucking animaniac on it. He sound, you know what I'm saying? He sound like a fucking the Tasmanian devil came out the barbershop with a tape up. And I'm not, I'm not here for it. You know what I'm saying? It just wasn't, it wasn't sliding for me. And what's crazy is he was a little more in on pot in the pocket than the second dude. And the second dude 
sounded better. Like his voice matched with the beat a little bit, but he was a little off of his pocket too. Like he started strong, but he was doing him out of the pocket shit was a lot of just like new rapper fucking nuances. Like when you're fresh to rapping and you make a couple of mistakes. I mean, if you're not fresh to rapping and you're making these mistakes, then my bad. You just need to listen to somebody when they tell you something because you don't just think you got it. But the beat, cold. Hook, cold. That solo shit at the end, cold. First verse, trash. Second verse, okay. So this gets a thumbs up for me because a majority of it I rock with. But I am very disappointed. I, I do feel like they did not do justice to that dope ass sample. And that sample is, we've heard that sample on, it's been all over the place. It's just a solid sample. You gotta keep it, like it's a dope sample. Like don't just ruin samples that we all know of. Like I know it's exciting to want to rap over these things, but like it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But I, I fucked with that, that beat and that sample for sure. So anyway, so this next one, I'm hoping this one cooks because it's called Inauguration by Captev, Captev, and this dude, he got fucking, he got fucking uh, frosted tip locks. He light skin as hell. He looked like me if I had a better skin routine and my fucking mustache and beard combo was symmetrical and I dyed my shit on some raiding shit. So this shit better be woke or I'm going to be pissed off. But this one's called Inaugura Inauguration by Captain. They got a picture of fucking Biden and Harris fucking doing their little little thing. Except, you know, Harris don't got no mask on and Biden does. She not out here being safe, practicing social distancing and all that safe shit. We got UK strains out here killing people in Jersey. Everybody want to go out and eat dinner. But anyways, Inauguration. <laughs> Up the stocks and the profit told mama that this is a go. Okay, break off the trees like I'm Danny. That's extra light. Me and the bros. She keep it litty because when the Rona over, she want to roll. When we hit the road, we hit the road. Oh. Too many hands in your pockets while I'm finding pockets. No, we ain't the same. Attracting the same energy that you keep only way to get far in this game. If I got the knowledge they wanted, I tell my niggas they can get it for free. Everyone eats so she catered to me. Get a little kid. Blowing her back out. Pretty little thing might send her that cash out. She throwing that ass back. Baby, you're savage. I hit it like blackjack. Then I might bash that. Can't get attacked. Gotta get to these rack racks. Better go bag that. Or the next man do it like a waste might snatch that. Watch how I glitch. Houdini with the hoes. Watch how she dips. Play the market smart. Cash in the dip. Sticking to the script. Watch how I flip. Different cloth talk. Best come equipped. Thread game done. Bless up the drip. Exotic foreign auto. Bless up the whip. Love on my haters. I blow them to kiss. Oh. Oh my days, I wish a nigga would try to come this way Baby list niggas trying to catch this fade My dog keep a stick and he like to play Make him say The heat on auto like M.I.A I keep a big three like I'm down in BK If you play you get offs like LBJ Yeah I ain't got time for no conversation Unless it's pertaining to money inflated And translate into a sunny vacation My nigga I'm saying My mind on the grind and the grind making payments They're straight from the pavement We built the foundation from talks in the basement From Orleans to Haven Look what we created This feeling's amazing Shout out my steppers for keeping it real, never being pretenders. There for the low, so we winning together. I'm thankful for y'all, I'm forever indebted. You know who you are. Remember them nights that we'd wish on a star. They align from afar. We never fold it. We bend, but don't break. Now we raising a bar. The future is limitless. The way that I see it, prosperity's imminent. I stay highly spirited. I pray to protect me from anything villainous. Connected like pyramids. Proceed with precision. The gang moving militant. We did our due diligence. We come up together and light up like filaments. Whoa. Count up the stocks and the profits. Told mama that this is a go. Break off the threes like I'm Danny. That's 14 for me and the bros. Hey. She keep it litty because when the Rona over, she want to roll. Well, we hit the road. We hit the road. Oh. <laughs> I fuck with this track, bro. I don't know why I fuck with that track. It's track fucking exciting, bro. The beat is just big and it's exciting. And then he got this wild ass, extremely light skinned voice, bro. Like, I guarantee you, 
this dude does not walk outside during any weather with any sort of things on his feet besides nothing or sandals. So I'm not mad at it, bro. I'm not mad at it. Like, I like the vibe. First verse was a little weird, but it had good moments. The second verse had, like, really good highlights. I like the hook. It's a vibe, bro. I fuck with this, bro. I, I really like this beat, bro. This beat, beat's exciting. He didn't do no political woke shit type stuff, but I'm not mad. <laughs> oh, if you're not feeling it, you're not feeling it. I like the beat. I like the fucking bam, bam, bam. Like, this shit remind me of, like, you know, when cats fucking... This is how, like, the fucking dudes in, like, the 2000s would drop singles with these big-ass loops. Like, these very aggressive, booming loops. But I like it, bro. Like, that shit remind me of something that, like, Charles Hamilton used to type, used to rap on and shit like that. So I'm not mad at it. And he was just sliding. He was mixing up his flow and shit. What you mean the beat's too hard, season? What that mean? What that mean is too hard, sir? <laughs> but yeah, man, I, 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 I'm not mad at it. I kind of enjoy myself with that one. That's something that I want to do. Got it to go. That's just fire, bro. So this next one, um, that's a wave emoji for me easily, easily. So this next one, hey, shout out to the homie who's in the room. So this next one is called Sydney Montclair Freestyle by Perico Corleone. So I see you in here. We get to see your stuff. We get to see how you do. I see you being active and all that good stuff in the chat. Don't mean I'm going to be nice to you, but this better slap, my guy. It was two minutes. Okay, some Griselda type shit about to happen, huh? This better make you feel gross. And get your money, young king, praying on niggas what a shame. Your life light revolve around the high life and highlights on I-9, the price right, baking and cooking bricks, moving out my mother's ditch, what a wish on five nights, and shooting stars, they aim for the moon, poppy move, loose some rope, set the mood, we making mafia moves, suede interior, master vintage, mass percentage, fanny skis, possessions, McQueen scarves the essence, bond clear coats, fulfill my blessings, I like money in bundles, fuck a nine to five is stressing, what's the bit rate, pockets out of shape, plus them calories, Charge. Oh, you capping like you actively fraud. Force dock is exposed, snitching it toe. Bitches in your DNA, ran up on a plug. Addicted to drugs, your baby mother strung. Crack cat sporadic. Like, like crack cat sporadic. Word, like, and bitches love Don Perico. Perico Coleon, buzz grates with my apes. Fettuccine and rum. rum, rum, rum. keep it a stack with you i'm very let down by this track and it's it's not even because like it's like a bad track or anything like that i i rock with the beat the mix is very weak yeah the mix was very weak like i rock with that beat i like that fucking dark griselda type creepy almost lo-fi type shit i love shit like that so i was really really rooting for it but i think what threw me off what gives it the okay is i feel like the i like what you were talking about like I like what you were talking about. The mix was weak. I like what you was talking about in there. And I'm really feeling like the fucking, you know, I like the pocket. I like the rhymes. I just feel like for that kind of grime, either the fucking mix could have done something to up your voice a little bit. Because it definitely needed to be louder. But also, I think that fucking, for a beat that filthy, bro, I need, you were giving me like a, a fucking R&B song type delivery, bro. You were delivering it to me like, you know, like, you was delivering it like you was fucking feeding the song grapes, bro. I needed you to fucking come as filthy as that beat was. Like, that beat's disgusting. But, like, I, I get what you're doing, but, like, maybe the mix or something like that. But I feel like that tone could be just a little more gritty with that eerie fucking background kind of layer you were throwing at it. That fucking, like, 
double you were throwing in there, I feel like that double solid with like a dope thing rather than the breathy kind of. It felt like, you know what I'm saying? It didn't feel like the shit you were saying. It didn't match the shit you were saying. But I'm going to give that an okay because I did rock with the beat and I saw the potential. Like, I didn't fucking hate it. Like, I'm just mad because I wanted to fucking rock with it. So you're going to get that okay from me. But, yo, the work, yo, if you putting out music like that and if you're rapping like that and you making beats like that, talk to me, bro. Hit me up. Let's let's talk. Let's talk something. I got a project out that's around that vibe that's gritty like that. But, y'all, fuck with shit like that. But, like, hit us up. Send us some stuff. Like, but you, you, got, you got most of the elements down, so... Don't 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 switch shit up too much. You know what I'm saying? Like don't don't switch shit up too much. You just gotta, you know, find what's gonna catch the ear and kind of you want to bring when you have a beat that's like that, that's kind of like slow to some people. Some people won't understand it. Some people will type shit. You want to really bring it to life. You want to really bring that shit to life. And the only way you can bring a beat like that, that's just a simple loop and like a kind of vibe is to have a fucking crazy delivery and your cadence has to fucking bring that shit fucking, you know what I'm saying? Like, you got to bring that shit home. So, this next one is uh, it's called With You by Status 631. I grabbed another Status single. I know Status loves when I listen to his music. So, I'd rather grab it and listen to here than listen to it in my own privacy. So, if I cook him, I'm cooking him in front of the boys. You feel me? Trust. I believe most times people really feel lust. This is different with you. <laughs> it's so different with you. <laughs> Don't do that status. <laughs> I won't say I ever fell in love, but I feel like I got addicted to your touch. This is something with you. I'm so addicted to you. I feel like status is singing this to me. Yeah. Gonna get married, but what you doing tomorrow? Been through it too, but I refuse to drown through my sorrows. Making a new life, having some fun with it. Seeing if you wanna come along, forget some bullshit. What up? Have a few laughs, maybe even assess. How roll up, we could talk. How both our lives a mess. <laughs> At least we got each other. When I'm with you, I don't stress. When you in my arms, I want you safe and nothing less. Fat. This isn't a love song, I'm keeping it real. Word. I'm trying to explain to you how I feel. I'm saying, look in my eyes, you can see something real. Something about you intrigues me, you know the deal. I was thinking, wanna go for dinner? We already friends. Word. Maybe even get a kiss when the night ends. What up? Tell me what's on your mind, cause you're on mine. Cause when I'm with you, I love your vibe You a real I could say I barely ever trust I believe most times people really feel lust It's just different with you It's so different with you I won't say I ever fell in love But I feel like I got addicted to your touch It's just something with you I'm so addicted to you when I feel some type of way, it's easy to open up. Yeah. To be honest, trust is big. I don't have it much. Nah. Been done dirty too many times. Yeah, life's been rough. Word. But that's my past. Looking forward, things are looking up. What's on your mind? Let's talk about you for once. I know your ex put you through it. What do you do for fun? Tell me. When you look into my eyes, there's more. I don't know what. Something's on your mind. I won't force you to speak up. I can see it. Every time I'm with you, it feels good, I can't front. I get excited every time I'm pulling up. Love how we chill, smoke a blunt, talk about it all and live it up. But there's one subject we never touch. It's the way you hold me tight whenever we hug. It's the times we call each other when our lives feel fucked. I'm curious, what comes to mind when I bring us up? Not jump into anything serious, be a company I do love. I can say I really ever trust. I believe most times people really feel lust. It's just different with you. It's so different with you. I won't say I ever fell in love, but I feel like I got addicted to your touch. It's just something with you. I'm so addicted to you. 
god. Your status. You owe me three and a half minutes, man. You owe me three and a half minutes, man. Come on, bro. Come on. So we're gonna keep it. We're gonna keep it a stat. I, that's a that's gonna that's a dumpster juice emoji. That's a that's a garbage bin emoji for me. But I will give the critique. That song's way too long. So the beat. I wasn't feeling a beat, first and foremost. The beat was a bit simple, a bit corny. I didn't like that whole sample in there. It felt like a cheat, like someone who just wasn't in that mood to make an emotional beat. And someone's like, yo, you got to make an emotional beat. And they made a beat and it just has no emotion in it. But it's trying really hard. It's trying its hardest. But then, like, yo, the hook. Oh, my God. Status, bro. The, the, the little hint of auto-tune. It's like, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. And then, and then, oh my God, you got the little, I mean, if you're going to sing, just go for it. Fuck it. You know, just go for it. I can hear the hesitation. It probably took you a thousand tries. Just go for it. If you're going to sing, fuck it. Get after it. You know what I'm saying? So that was just like, oh my goodness. And then you got the, 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 the cringe verse. Oh my goodness. I could not. So What's crazy is status rapping at a slow pace like that, you're definitely in like a better pocket because like I could see that, but I can see that kind of threw you off a little bit, which is dope. Salute to trying things. Always try new things. But like there is a certain amount like status is, if you guys don't know, status is a very brash rapper. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, the track definitely should be a little faster because his, that's just more his pace. He's more of a faster type track, like faster type artist, but he also is a very brash artist. So that's why a lot of those ad libs would just fucking punch you in the ear. He's like, yo, I'll feed you, you know, I'll get you a chicken sandwich from Chick-fil-A. And then it's like, facts, you know, the fucking ad lib punches you in the back of the head. And you're like, what the fuck just happened, bro? Like if I was driving and I had a coffee, bro, I would have spilled that shit on myself. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, bro, you got to chill with that. And it's like... Honestly, I'm going to keep it a bajillion, bajillion percent. If you are not the smoothest person, and, and it's no disrespect, you know, I'm not saying like whatever, but some people got a certain smooth swag, like, you know what I'm saying? And I'm not talking about them fake light-skinned niggas that hump the air on TikTok and do all that shit just to show off like two out of four abs. No, if you don't have like a natural comfort and like kind of a swag or a sauce to you, then a smooth track might not be a thing. And even if you don't got that, if you don't have like a smooth or a saucy flow, you know what I'm saying? If you don't have like a flow that you can like weave in and out of, and also it, it's, it's different arts that kind of go with these type of songs. If you haven't mastered those things, then these tracks are stuff that you should spend a little more time kind of in the, keep a little in the oven for longer and work a little bit harder like this is a track that if someone had like a very dope in and out flow where they can do a fast line and then stop on like one word or even drake big sean rap talk it like you know j cole talk rap it that kind of smooth kind of cadence and shit like that or even if you have just a dope such a dope voice that your voice almost comes off as singing then yeah, Status is an energy guy. He's got to go nuts. Like, and if you don't have that, like, kind of almost singy type thing, then then there's no shame in your game if you get someone to sing for you. And if you get a singer, like a singer could have went nuts with that hook. A singer could have done ad libs behind you and fucking you know got rid of the you punching me in the ear type stuff and kind of gave it like a dope, 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 smooth vibe. You know what I'm saying? So it's 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 a lot, and I get it. Like, I love the message. I love that you want to write about stuff like that. And, you know, you just want to keep it real, got a little personal, this, that, and the fifth. But, like, you got to, it's just hard. You got to really feel these type of things. You know what I'm saying? And it, it's hard, bro. And, I like, I'm a person, like, even in my music, I, I take a lot of pride in my flow because I, I spend a lot of fucking time perfecting my flow and studying different flows and mastering flows and shit like that. And it's like, if I know that I'm probably going to need some auto-tune, I'd much rather reach out than fucking, you know, sit here and just get you know get my ass fucking handed to me by some light-skinned nigga on a futon in his living room with pink and blue glow lights so but anyways we're gonna jump right back into this we got another one this one's called no role models by jig stack so this is a soundcloud one so the quality may not be up there but hey fuck it let's go for it
Chicks, thanks. I'm about to go dumb on this shit. I used to get stuck in the timeline. Some of you pussies been capping, you ain't about no action, real shit, there's a fine line. I always get caught in the middle like Malcolm, I wiggle to get in the limelight. No shooters, you ain't got the pistol, what's that to a missile, brought a knife to a gunfight. Handle your own problems. I learned to handle my own, that's why I lost faith in my role models. Handle your own. Handle your own problems. I'm on a private jet flying to Cali, we popping Patron bottles. I'm on a private jet flying to Cali, we popping Patron. I had to get up and get it. Too many nights we was down on our asses, it's classic. Now I can never forget it. Some of my brothers in prison locked up in these tragic. We only talk about inventors. Pray every night I wake up in the morning, no capping. Won't leave my family defenseless. They told me to leave, never follow. I was at the bottom trying to get a follow. Pinpoint hit with hollows. Now we on the road pushing in full throttle. Philosophy like Aristotle. I could write a book of war winning novels. Catch me stacking up till it all topples poolside, chilling, swimsuit. Models, protect and protect. Nah, I used to lay low, keep my head in my tech. Chasing the bag and the check. Gotta keep moving, cause they aiming way above next. Don't care about who it affects. It's all in PR. I'm talking about money, respect. The this words they taking me snapping. next. Bringing your army to peace, that's for pirates, say less. Handle your own problems. I learned to handle my own. That's why I lost faith in my role models. I fucking feel that. Handle your own problems. Yeah, and I don't got time for the games. Lately, I've been up just thinking I'm trying to make money. Don't care if it comes with the fame. Half of y'all don't even know me. I've been on my dolly. Don't ever say we are the same. My last a movie, and if you just knew me, you probably would know that my price was the pain. Oh hey, goodness. I told y'all to handle your own. If you get caught alone, you better be ready. Don't bother to pick up the phone. Want y'all to see what I'm on. This is my lifestyle. That's what it's been all along. Welcome to my side of town. It's not all that bright. Let's see if you really that strong. So... Handle your own problems. I learned to handle my own. That's why I lost faith in my role models. That's why I lost faith in my role Handle your own. Handle your own problems. I'm on a private jet flying to Cali. We popping Patron bottles. Yeah, yeah. Jake Stacks, you know the vibes. Oh, man. That was a fucking fun time. That was a good ass time, bro. Are you kidding me with that fucking track? Like, are you kidding me? I like that shit because it was straight to the point and it was short and he didn't fucking have to go crazy. Like, he fucking, not only was he delivering the shit out of that song, he was like, yo, I am going to fucking, I am going to just black out real quick and that's it and even on the hook he still kind of kept that cadence but he had he made sure you knew it was a hook by the you know the repetitiveness and the fucking vibe of it but it, it was super fucking clean bro like that shit fucking slapped like that and he was talking nice bro like i learned how to make money on my mo my own that's why i don't got role models i'm here with that he did sound like young muscle bro. <laughs> he did sound like young ma yo he got the same raspy ass voice don't do that to him. Don't do that to the young blood, man. But um, yo, I'm fucking. I'm not mad at that, bro. He definitely did sound young too. But like, I'm not mad at that shit at all, bro. Like, that was a fucking dope ass vibe, man. He was out here fucking blacking the fuck out, bro. Salute to him, bro. That's good penmanship too. Like, that's a good, good fucking, good fucking energy. So um, we got a couple more left. I got two unreleased, but before that, I got one more release that was uh, sent on some Dookie Dookie shit because this is on some YouTube shit. So. We're just going to get to it. So this one's called, and that last one was a fire emoji. So this one's called Mud Bolivia. Toot it up. I guess the artist is Mud Bolivia. And it's called Toot it up. Featuring CO, Lee Baby, Anonymity, and Britney. Who the fuck is Britney? It's Britney, bitch. This video is funny looking. I'm not going to share it with y'all, but it's very, very clear. It's high quality.
This is wild. That was an experience. That was a <laughs> yo. That, that was an experience, bro. Like, <laughs> like that song needs to be heard by people. And for everybody that's joining in on this, you'll be you'll be safe. But I am going to send this song to everyone that I love and tell them that it's fire because of how ridiculous it was like i don't know where to start like at how fucking entertaining this track was so one the the, the beginning of the hook her fucking her fucking tone <laughs> and then just getting aggressive is hysterical to me the fact that it's called tooted up and they only said tooted up at the end of the song is fucking ruining me because they said bust it up 10,000 times. The first dude, I could just see him in the booth with an earpiece and a Kangol hat, and I fucking love it. He went from zero to 100 immediately. He went from, like, talking regular, like, sly shit to just full-on creepy uncle who loves asking their, like, college cousin you know college nephew about all the trim and the girls he's getting and then they just take it way too far you know what i'm saying like i can put a hundred dollars that whoever that dude was has shown his nephews all of his nephews a picture of someone naked that is way older than their nephew but also just not good looking just like the the grandma next door type shit and they loved it like these niggas have to be 40 there is no way and then the second dude this was a wild song bro this was so aggressive this is going on my make love mix and that's a fucking fact people do need to know about how wild this song was like are you kidding me bro Jesus. <laughs> so now we're going to get into the two songs, <laughs> the two unreleased songs, and I'm going to close on that. I can give that, that song is, <laughs> you know, they, yeah, they have, their merch is going to be NSF. It's like, you can't wear it to work. Good thing we're working from home. But like, that song, for me, is two ratings. Not only is that song a garbage truck, it is also a diamond. All right. It is both. That song is a duality, and I fucking love that. So let's get on with these next two songs. So this next one is called Off Broadway by the homie uh, D. Meddy. Yo, as a fact, it's going on my make love list. I'm about to scare the living shit out of Bay. And uh, yeah, <laughs> dude, that song put so many songs to shame. Like, that song was so wild. I... I wish it had a music video for scientific purposes, for research. But uh, this next one is Off Broadway by D. Meddy. That was fucking wild, bro. That was wild.
Welcome to the main event. Amazing pen since the age of 10, I elevate again. Play to win, let the insane commence. Going crazy, but in the greatest sense. No one face me, got a great defense. There's attack non stop, like an onslaught to the bar drop. But they tap in the arm lock, rap on the song drop. Never take a break again. Either break arms or break bread. How the state set crucial, break a leg. Hack the scene, I'ma play my part. And add to the art while you take instead. I mean to your ends, never mean with the pen below average though. Your freak with the booth the most is never savage mode. And that's apropos, hit the stool on the avenue. Going back and forth with your attitude. The bare minimum, what they granting you. They hype you up and you ain't have a clue. The game full of fakes and stakes, so let you fade the case. So vacate your place and elevate the stakes. You gotta take your space and make it great and known it. So nobody take away what you got and what you're trying to get. Never stop and you'll find success. So pay homage, confess your sins. It's worth the price of admission. A die for less on the idle steps. Gotta try your best to stay true or improve your performance. You better off dormant. All cap, now you force a star on the role of informant. Made no sense like a xenophobe, but a foreign. Now keep the roads and they swarming. Now peep the show, the crowd roaring. Many up and smoke the loud on them. Bright lights from night to the morning. Now the intermission seem insufficient. Dissect the message, take it all in. I started by firing shots with intention. I'm mad, it's dramatic, inspired. The lesson, the bullet go back in the gun when I finish. Play rewind while I'm skimming through tenor. Yeah, got it all backwards, just heard, never listen. Read the lines and you waste the audition. The show must go on with a triumph for tragedy. This the underground masterpiece. I'm up like the mezzanine. Is that a tenant bar? Scene, it's a recurring dream. Lines slightly changed to focus on different themes. Huh? The rapper compelled to do typical things. Talk up material, tangible things. Trying to stand out but can handle a pen. Trying to stand out but that's Prince of Fit Dan. Spend it ridiculous to look the same. Sloppy, meticulous, not on his frame. More on his sanity, not gonna change. Focused on vanity, out least the range. No growth to clarity, boxed in his lane. So insecure and he slight as his name. So insecure and he fight into his lane. Thought is the cure him and right for the brain. A revelation set the bar and raise it. This the elevation, make the search a favorite. No need to prove on a constant of fool without conscience. The character you playing. We all got free will, but not all of us skilled. Some will embarrass for entertainment. The best I've established, dedication. A lyrical classic, expectation. I said for myself and I'm gonna make it. Regret all the time that I spent and wasted on inanimate props. I can't say for granted the talent I got. So on stage, I'ma shine with purpose. I'ma rhyme it perfect till the final curtain. I'ma stick to the script, redesign and breaking who I am for certain. will survive the worst in. Made no sense like a xenophobe in a foreign. But peep the roads and they swarming. Now peep the show, the crowd roaring. Many up and smoke the loud on them. Bright lights from night to the morning. Now you try to make sense. So the end and dissect the message, shake it all in. I started by firing shots with intention. I'm mad, it's dramatic, inspired the lesson. The bullet go back in the gun when I finish. Play with wine while I'm skimming through ten and you got it all backwards. Uh, just to listen. Read the line, then you'll listen to the show. Uh, another triumph for tragedy. tragedy. It's the underground masterpiece. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh man. Alright. So that fucking slap. Easy, easy, easy fire emoji for me. Only if I have to give any sort of criticism, because this is this song is for this is the rappers rapper type music right here. Like, yeah, it's got the new age kind of style. You do the new age hook, you do the flow and all that shit, but it is not. It, it, it is the rappers rapper type shit. Like, and only thing that I can say to critique, and it's not even coming from like a for me to enjoy it more. I enjoyed the shit out of this. It's when the hook kicks in the hook if something has to do like something to the voice and not even like the hook is dope something to your voice maybe even a full-on double just layered behind it on some bone thug shit something with the double a little more than the ad libs to make that hook separate a little more would probably make it a little more digestible yeah, yeah, you feel me on the hook. I think that I like the hook too. I think the hook was solid. I think it's just when you hear so much rapping, so much of him rapping in that voice, and then he goes into that that hook with that same rap voice, you know what I'm saying? And it doesn't give you the contrast that you need to like turn your brain off for a bit because he is beating the shit out of you with bars. And the hook has crazy bars too. That tenant shit, I fucking loved it over it. It's just like yeah, you didn't know it was exactly. You don't know it's a hook. Like that's why I was like that tenant bar. But then I realized it was a, I didn't realize it was a hook until the end. And that shit right there, you need something, just a little more, to turn it into, you know what I'm saying, a hook hook for people to digest it. But other than that, that's fucking fire to me. If you did something like that, that could separate it. That would get a lot of people do it. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's 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 a dope bridge. Like it's a, yeah, it's more like a bridge, but still like it has to separate it. Like. It, something to and that's not even for me i fuck with it the way it is i'm just saying like someone else trying to digest it you know what i'm saying someone else that's you're just beating them to death with raps bro like that's they need that like they need something that's saying hey this is a bridge 
A, this is a hook, you know, like the first time and the last time. But yo, fire, bro. That track fucking slap, bro. I'm fucking here for that. Yeah, man, you need those things. You need those cues. People ain't that. Yo, d you got to understand. The way you write, bro, people aren't that smart. People aren't that smart, bro. Like, you're giving people way too much credit. Like, you're giving people way too much credit, bro. Like, unless you're trying to break genius.com or some shit like that, bro, you need to relax or calm down, all right? And this is going to be the last one I play for the night. This one's called Go Yard by The Season. Yo, Season, two people of your team caught some heat from me tonight. I don't want to do this to you, man. It's better to slap. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Yeah, look, hey yo, I found myself summer stuck in the middle, not quite my dream. I'm cooler than a cup of coffee, hotter than ice cream. People think I'm dope, but no, I don't get paid the right things. Well, not enough to live, but I can take the wifey sight scenes. See, love don't cost a thing, but people tend to be fickle. So love can seem to sum like an impossible riddle. <laughs> but it's like anything you get what you've been putting in from from the beginning. It'll turn out artificial, bad handwriting, trying to stick to the scribble. I'm cooking up that dope, I stay in front of the griddle. <laughs> I do the most, but really only show a little. It's got to change like quarter penny, diamond, nickel. Dollar and a dream, rocking Ross for less, not supreme. Don't need no box, logo, hoodie, I got self-esteem. But that doesn't mean that I don't enjoy the finer things. I'm just trying to see a strike before I fucking swing. And go yard out the park, no more play plays. Stay on your toes like you're practicing your ballet. Cause I can skate them thin nights. I learned from Golden Bombay. And I'm hungrier than ever, please don't turn into an entree. And go yard out the park, no more play plays. Stay on your toes. Like you're practicing your ballet Cause I can skate them thin nights I learned from Golden Bombay uh, I'm hungrier than ever Please don't turn into an entree Woke up, I had to get it. There's too many players and not enough positions. But who we kidding? Me and my niggas came to win this. When the prices are cash, glory, and women, it's about time I think that they should witness. Been rapping for years and I ain't know what finished. Setting my mark with the ink and pad. I'm dream chasing, doing a hundred on the dash. I flip the bird when the haters, I'm passing them by. On this road of riches, I'm bringing my whole squad. I mean, every wolf got it packed by their side. And my team hungry to do what it takes survive don't be surprised when this wave turns to tsunami celebrations at the mansion backyard party where the bras pull up bras come off yeah probably just so they can have fun with the squad properly that's what's up and go yard at the park no more play play stay on your toes like you're practicing your ballet cause i can skate them thin nights i learned from golden bombay and i'm hungrier than ever please don't turn into an entree and go yard at the park no more play play stay on your toes like you're practicing your ballet cause i can skate them thin nights i learned from golden bombay and I'm hungrier than ever, please don't turn into an entree. All right, solid, solid. So, um, I, I, I'll keep it a buck. Like, this is gonna get for me, it's gonna get uh, it's gonna get a thumbs up, but like, because of very small things. So, young, smooth, he 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 snapped. And I feel like the way his delivery and stuff like that, he fucking definitely shined. Like, he shined a lot. Like, he nailed it on this track. And the production's super smooth. I, I'm not feeling, it's not, I'm not feeling the hook, but it's because it sounded like, like, I know you like to do your in and out thing, and your voice is very instrument, like, your voice is an instrument, bro. And, and I appreciate that about your music. I always have. But it's something about, like, your delivery on this hook on here has like a bit of a delay where it almost gives you the it gives me the sensation like it makes me feel like it's off but it's also on and it's just like something that like this just there's a lot of sharpness to it and it's smooth it's delivered smoothly and it just doesn't like sit right with me you know what i'm saying like it's just doesn't feel like enough to make me really want to get into it. I feel like I need something a little bit smoother on the hook. Like I need it to go full smooth. And um, but I'm actually surprised. Like at first when I heard it, I was like, oh, I hear these effects on his voice. I'm like, this is the auto tune he is talking about. But I'm not mad at the auto tune though. It definitely fits the vibe. But I, honestly, for this type of track though, I I I don't think you need it. I don't think you need it. I think you have you already have a dope tone. To your voice already that fits with it so i don't feel like it's needed but i mean if you know if you're feeling it that's 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 fair too i just feel like that might be a little overkill especially considering how clean 
your features voice was and the contrast almost seems like it 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 doesn't give it the contrast where it's like they're working back to back kind of thing it kind of makes it seem like this dude's a little more confident in his sound because he don't need the auto-tune and then you you know needed the auto-tune because maybe you weren't hitting the notes like you wanted to so it feels like you know what i'm saying so but i like the verse i definitely like his or i prefer his verse more i like his delivery and i just feel like a few like really simple touch-ups on there and you got like a, a, a fucking banger like this is very 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 close to being like very dope like because all the elements are there like i like the beat I, I like the feature, you know what I'm saying? I like the fucking concept of the hook and all that stuff. I just need that hook delivered. Sm I need it smooth. Like, this track needs to be butter, bro. It needs to be very, it needs to be butter. And it's like right there, you know what I'm saying? Very small, small things that I'm just like, yo, I think this could be ironed out easily. But super solid track. I'm going to give this a thumbs up in its state. But uh, see, but on his... You can't hear it as much as on yours. Like on yours, it's it's kind of it's like surrounding your voice. And on his, I barely even notice because his cadence and delivery just seems so compared to yours seems very dry. You know what I'm saying? Like his voice compared to yours seems very very just like boom. It's like I'm on. It's like rasping. Yours seemed like entangled by a lot of effects. You know, but but I mean this one. I you know I know you doing your things with the mixing stuff. So but like. <laughs> I feel that. Yeah, I definitely feel that getting past the record. You're like, I'm going to put it in the state that it's in. But honestly, you got so much going on for it that like you can just get away by doing some simple stuff. But yeah, hey, man, it's super dope. I mean, it's solid, though. It's a very solid track. I feel like a lot of people will rock with it. But for some people might not be able to understand like if something does rub them the wrong way. But hey, shout out to you, man. This is dropping on Thursday. This is Go Yard by Season featuring Young Smooth produced by Jack Winter, bro. Super solid, though, man. Good for you, man. Good for you, you know. But that's all I got for the night. I got my streams going. I'm going to go play some VR and have a good time. You can follow me on everything at John D. Who. Follow Not Your Mans on everything or go to our website, notyourmans.com. Whatever feels good for you. We are on everything social media. We don't do too much on Twitter, but we post our reviews. But our reviews are on Instagram. I let people know when we're going to do these live streams. We do the single streams every Monday. So if you have singles and shit comes up or you see a single from someone whose girlfriend got a fat butt and she turned you down to high school so you don't like him and you think his raps suck, send that shit to us and we will put it on the list. Hit us up. Check our story. That's usually where we update on there too. And Tuesdays, we do full album reviews. I do full album reviews on here. So you'll see me tomorrow doing an album review. And if you have something you think you want to fit the live gauntlet, then go for it, man. Get a lot of people in there. Yeah, I appreciate you guys for jumping in and taking a listen to this. I enjoy doing this. I am a music guy. I listen to music all fucking day. This is very fun for me. It's a good time. And I appreciate people who jump in and actually talk. When people just send me blind singles and they don't actually jump in and participate or even listen to the view, what the fuck was the point? If you're at work or some shit like that, cool, but I know who's stopping in and who's not because y'all motherfuckers ain't watching the shit when I post it and it's probably getting hit with them copyright claims, but this is super solid, bro. If you guys think it's a good idea, let me know what's going on. Let me know if you guys fuck with the whole live thing. I think I'm going to do this. I do this every Monday and Tuesday and I'm kind of keeping with the wave because it fits my schedule and it feels good, but um, yeah, man, no doubt, man. I appreciate you guys. Some dope music. Make sure to send everybody that song by that crazy fucking Mud Bolivia, all right? But yeah, again, John D. Who, catch me at Not Your Mans on everything. If you have an Oculus Quest 2, hit me up so we can play some video games whenever because I'm always on that shit. Other than that, I'll holla at y'all, man. Peace out, peoples. And again, I fucking appreciate y'all, man. Peace.